I would start by saying that this is a deeply personal decision and I can fully understand how it will vary from one pregnant woman to another and would even vary depending on the stage of the pregnancy where they are at. Unfortunately, pregnant women were not included in the studies, so we don't have long-term safety data for this specific group of people. The reasons that made me decide to get the vaccine was that um, in terms of the vaccine itself, the vaccine is not a live virus vaccine, which is the type of vaccine that we avoid um, during pregnancy. And then the other components that are included in the vaccine, none of them are what's called adjuvants. And the other stuff that's in it, it's are things that are commonly used in other for manufacturing other medical products. So I said, okay, it is expected to be safe. In terms of risk, um, pregnant women who get COVID have much higher risk of severe disease that even needs ICU admission or sometimes mechanical ventilation and higher risk of dying than non-pregnant women. So as a pregnant healthcare worker, I had to balance all of the all of these things, you know. And that's why at the end of the day, I decided that I would get the vaccine.